What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. And one of today's online challenges is pick Hummingbird Sage. The first location is right here in Lemoyne on the O in Lemoyne. The reason I'm showing you this is because, is because we have evergreen huckleberries to pick today and that is where they are located. The only problem is sometimes there's not enough Hummingbird Sage spawning in that area. The best area I know to find enough hummingbird sage to be able to pick these five plants that you have to pick is here in Rhodes. You can see these three blue dots that I have marked on the map and that is where you want to be to find this hummingbird sage. Very plentiful and you can find this and do it, get this done very quickly. Of course most of you have probably been to this um, stranger mission a hundred times right here at this little kind of wooden house. You're going to go right behind this wooden house. That is where the first patch of hummingbird sage will be located in the woods. And like I said, all three of these are located right here close together. You don't have to go far at all to find any of these uh, hummingbird spa sage spawn points. But this is going to be the first area, like I said, right behind the stranger mission house. So if most of you know where the stranger mission is, it is very easy to find. And of course, hummingbird sage is pretty easy to notice. It has that purple top on it. And this can be found anywhere on the map, of course. But this area is my personal favorite because you can find it all in a very small location and get it done very quickly. After you have picked uh, all the hummingbird sage right here behind the house, the next area we're going to go to is dead center of the E in Rhodes. Once you get right here, there's another little small patch that is uh, kind of located in the woods as well. And there will be a few more hummingbird sage here also. Now, sometimes I'll come down here and there'll be more than just one or two spawn in these little spots. Usually there's always two, but sometimes there'll be three or four in these little areas. So just keep that in mind. You may come down here and get it done within two of these areas instead of having to go to all three. But the last spot is on a little trail right towards the uh, kind of below the S, but you'll see this little trail that runs down you know, kind of through the E. And there's like a little trail marked on the map. It's not really anything there, but it kind of shows a little gray line. And that is where the last area of hummingbird sage is located. And you can see there's a few more plants here. Guys, I hope this helped you out. Of course, if you liked it, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.